So I did a twist out on my hair. I'm interested in seeing how it comes out, you guys. I'm using this Luminel toothpaste, which has been working wonders. I actually have a dermatologist appointment. Um, I'm having like this little bit of an eczema flare up like on my hand. Um, it like comes and goes. <laughs> so I definitely said it's time for a dermatologist visit and get me something. I don't know if they're going to do a pill or a cream because like I said, I mean, today it's not even there. <laughs> like there's a spot so she'll be able to see. But it comes and goes. Like, I used to have very, very bad eczema growing up, like on the back of my knees, my neck. But thankfully, that's all cleared. And at the time, I think what really helped with getting rid of it was that I, um, I started using, um, uh, like Fragrance 3 products, of course. And then also I started, um, uh, not eating like any dairy products like i cut out dairy for a while and then that actually made me lose a lot of weight as well um but yeah i'm gonna do my makeup real quick and see the results of this twist out and see how i'm gonna rock my hair today and i'll be back okay, so i just made it to the dermatologist's office and we're going to head in now and see what's what Right there. Okay. So we're here now and I want to show you guys the twist out results. I just used a curl pudding, so next time I'll probably do it with gel or mousse and see those results. But it's giving body. I like it. Cuteness. So guys, I'm done with the dermatologist. She gave me some creams. I got this topical ointment. So I'm glad that like she said it's not severe at all. You know, it's very, very mild. Um, she said I was good to come in when I did to just get it under control. Um, but because like the eczema is in different places, like a decade later, <laughs> you know, I'm whole flare up in a totally different spot where I never had it before. She wants me to see an allergist. So I've got to schedule that appointment and then I follow up with her in a month. So right now I'm at Burger King because that's what the fam bam wanted. We'll eat that and then we're going to see the Super Mario Brothers movie. How can I help you? Hi, can I get the, um, what's the Whopper Junior meal? The, uh, number five, please? A medium or a large? Um, a medium with the Coke slushie. Anything else? And no pickles on that burger, please. And no pickles? Yes, no pickles. Anything else? Uh, let me get a cheeseburger kids meal. And with the frozen Coke as well. Okay. And let me get a kid's meal chicken nuggets. With the frozen Coke as well. Hey, kid's meal chicken nuggets? The mm -hmm. four piece or the six piece? Four piece is fine. And you said with the frozen Coke as well? Yes. Okay. And then I'm going to get the, uh, the spicy chicken. Does that have some type of sauce on it or the filet is spicy? I'm sorry, which one? The spicy chicken. It's a sauce. Oh, I don't want sauce. Um, can I get the classic chicken sandwich then, please? The meal? I'll take the meal. Thank you. You're welcome. Well, I'm back home for a moment. They're eating the Burger King, and then we're going to get ready. Head over to see the Super Mario Brothers. And to the yeah. movies to see. Mario, everybody. What do we Mario. see? Mario. Welcome back. Hey, Papa Bear. Hi. Let's party. Oh, yeah! Nice choice. Pump down here. Right now, pump down here. <gasps> he ate the carrots and drank the water. What? I see. I see. It's shoe pants. Footprints? I see. It's shoe pants. 
Oh my goodness. All right, guys. So I've been taking really good care of my natural hair. Um, as you guys saw earlier in the video, this is like a few days post the twist out. Maybe almost a week. And I'm going to do a avocado honey mask in my hair. I'm going to show you guys the ingredients. Actually, there's banana in it as well. Um, but it's definitely helped so much with my hair growth because I actually did the big chop back in, I want to say October, possibly November. Like it was right before really like the big holidays, like Thanksgiving, Christmas. And I mean, I'm talking about big chop. I wish I had a picture, but I got another phone and I don't think I have those. But, and just, you know, a matter of what? Like four or five months, my hair has grown tremendously. So I'm going to show you guys this mask that I use and we'll get into it now. Guys, I have a banana here, which helps with shine in the hair and softening it up. Then we have the avocado, which has numerous benefits, including repairing split ends um, from heat damage. And then we have olive oil, which produces extra moisture in your hair and softens it as well. And then we're topping this off with honey. Playing trances, going all to different places, different planets. Got your aura past me by losing balance. What if we run out of time and second chances? Empty handed. You like the fast life, you like the drive, get down dirty. I got the bad guy. Not to say this when I was showing you guys the ingredients, you're going to add in also a cheap conditioner. It can be Pantene Pro V, it can be Aussie. I love the Aussie products, but you're just gonna add maybe like like a quarter cup of conditioner just for some extra nourishment and it will add even more slip to the hair. I've been sinking lately, and it's hard to move. Think I'm stuck on so you guys, this is the consistency. I actually started putting some in already. Um, you see it moves. And I would do this, I section my hair into four sections to make sure it just penetrates all of those follicles. And I would do this, like I said before, you wanna do this on dry hair, it's a hair mask. Um, so, you're gonna put it in, then you're gonna leave it on for like 30 minutes to an hour. Today I'll probably do an hour. Um, you can sit under a hooded dryer if you have one. You can, wow, look at that growth, you guys. Ooh, it gets messy. Uh, but it's all actually nourishing, even for your skin. So hey, if it gets on, it gets on. Um, but, Yeah, I would do this twice a month, you guys. And for one of the times out of those two, I would add an egg into it. So that gives it a real, you know, protein treatment. You don't want to give your hair too much protein because then it'll get hard and dry and brittle. So that's why I recommend that only just the what time? I want to get my edges, my roots. Thinking about the way that this mask helps tremendously with repair and heat damage, and you guys will see that once we wash it out. This piece will be nice and curly. So, 
good to go. I'm gonna go ahead, watch the show for about an hour. Probably catch up on Love is Blind. Let me know what you guys are watching in the comments down below. And I will show you guys the results. I already told you what I'm gonna do. Shampoo, condition, um, and then I'll, I'll just, I'll show you guys after. I'm not gonna show you guys the whole process. Tons of YouTube videos showing you guys washing stuff like this out. So guys, I'm gonna use the rest of the mask and Lucas's hair. Ah! <laughs> it's right even in the middle And then we're gonna put a little pack or something on your head. The way you make me feel is crazy. How did you get so fly? You got me like... These are the results, you guys. See the shine. I'm probably gonna let it air dry about like 70%, and then I'll blow dry it out because uh, I want it straight. And that's Papa Bear. See the shine. So that's it for today, you guys. We'll see you guys in the next vlog. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Say bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube.